Today we are going to be all fancy and make an amazing strawberry cake for Valentine's, le fraisier. Step 1. The Genoise. In a large bowl, place the eggs. Add the sugar, vanilla sugar, and a pinch of salt. With an electric beater, beat the eggs for 10 minutes until the mixture becomes thick, whitish, and reaches the ribbon stage. Sift the flour and add it to the egg mixture. Using a spatula, gently mix in the flour into the batter in circular motions until well integrated. Pour the batter in a round baking pan covered with parchment paper. Bake in a preheated oven for about 30 minutes until your cake gets a beautiful golden color. Step 2. The Muslin Cream Place the milk in a large saucepan, heat on medium heat, and bring to a boiling point. In two large bowls, separate the egg yolks from the egg whites. Add the sugar, cornstarch, and a pinch of salt to the egg yolks. Using a whisk, mix well until you get a smooth texture. Once the milk reaches a boiling point, add it little by little to the egg mixture while whisking. If you add the hot milk all at once, or do not whisk at the same time, the eggs will cook, and you don't want that. Return the mixture in the saucepan, place on medium heat and cook for 5 minutes while continuously mixing with the whisk until the cream thickens. Place the pastry cream in a large bowl. Cover the pastry cream with a plastic wrap touching the surface to avoid the creation of a crust and place in the fridge for 30 minutes until it cools down. In a separate large bowl, place the butter at room temperature and mix with an electric beater until it becomes creamy. Add the pastry cream to the butter and continue mixing until you get a smooth cream. Step 3. The syrup. On medium heat, in a saucepan, place the water, sugar and vanilla sugar. Bring to a boil until the sugar is completely dissolved. Step 4. The cake assembly. First, cut off the stems of the strawberries and cut the strawberries in half. Once the cake has completely cooled down, cut it into two layers. Place a pastry circle on a cardboard, then place a cake layer first and brush it generously with the syrup. Place the strawberry halves on the edge around the cake. Add a layer of muslin cream over the cake and spread it evenly. Add a generous layer of strawberry halves. Cover the strawberries with a second layer of muslin cream. Finally, cover the cream with a second layer of cake and brush it with the syrup. Use the last one-third of the cream and melt to cover the top of the cake and even it out. Place the cake in the refrigerator for at least 3 hours until all the layers set. Step 5. The cake decoration. First, dust your workstation with some powdered sugar. Then roll the almond paste into a thin layer. Take the cake, still in the circle, and run a sharp knife around the edges of the circle. Place the almond paste layer on top of the cake and roll to help smoothen the surface. Cut out the edges of the almond paste. Use a sharp knife to clean the edges of the cake. Now press gently the center of the cake and use the other hand to remove the circle around the cake. Do some final cleaning, cut some strawberries for decoration, place them on the cake and dust the cake surface with powdered sugar. Place the cake in the fridge for 30 minutes to 1 hour and you are ready to serve. Check this out. This is pure heaven. Do we really need a special occasion to prepare this cake? I guess not. Bon appétit!